Hey guys, let's talk about the future of MTG Finance is probably in bulk. And the reason it is in bulk, given how card prices have recently been acting and behaving, given how often pe cards are reprinted in anthologies or Modern Masters or Eternal Masters or Eternal Masters again, it is v dual decks, commander decks. You can't really make money on cards that are 5 to $10 anymore because the risk of the card being reprinted is extremely high. Now, cards over $10, I would have no interest in speculating at all because the risk is so high that it's almost a guarantee that card will be reprinted. One of the things that or is difficult about high cards is conditioning matters, uh, pricing matters, as well as there is a limited amount of people who are interested in the $80 Liliana of the Veil, for instance, but many more people are interested in you know, a standard card, which is 5 to $10, maybe a land of some type. At the end of the day, it does appear to me that you can still make money from speculating, but it's in bulk. So when I mean bulk, I mean cards like this, which it says the all-time low is 31 cents, but honestly, this card has been below a quarter for the majority of its life. And only recently, as you can see, has it been trending up and up and up, even to to the point of cons of Tarkir. It looks like it was maybe 45 cents, 50 cents, TCG player mids. Now it is a $3 card and one that will be easy to move because when things trend up, it's easier to buy it or it's easier to sell it when there's hype around the card than when there's no hype at all. Take Lion's Eye Diamond, for instance. When there's hype around the card and the card is, you know, $250, finding a deal for $200 seems really, really good. But on the downside, if the card is $250, and there's no hype and people are fire selling the card even at $200 you might not feel comfortable buying it although that's the same price point because the trend the trend of this card is up the trend of lion's eye diamond is down you don't want to be buying on the downtrend unless you have some other information so in the future of mtg speculation mtg finance is in bulk you cannot rely on $10 cards you definitely cannot rely on $80 Liliana of the Veils that's our lion's eye diamond you can't rely on 200 dollars lion's eye diamonds because things have been changing quite and i appreciate the change i support the change but it is important to know that it is a change nonetheless anyway bye guys